Welcome to my channel. Learn English with Jasmine. Hi, friends. Today's topic is kindness. Listen carefully and then repeat after me. Kindness is a wonderful thing that makes people happy. When we are kind, we do nice things for others. For example, we can help our friends when they're feeling sad. We might share our toys or give a big smile to someone who looks lonely. Being kind means we care about how others feel. We can also be kind to animals. We can give food to birds or pets. When we're kind, it's like we're spreading love all around. Even small acts of kindness, like saying please and thank you, are important. These words show that we're polite and thoughtful. Kindness doesn't have to be big or fancy. We can be kind by listening when someone talks to us. It's like giving them a gift of our attention. We can also help our family by setting the table or cleaning up. These actions show that we care about our home and the people in it. When we're kind, we make the world a better place. People feel happy when someone is kind to them. It's like a warm hug for their heart. So let's remember to be kind every day, and we'll see how it brings smiles to everyone. Now repeat each sentence after me. Kindness is a wonderful thing that makes people happy. Kindness is a wonderful thing that makes people happy. When we are kind, we do nice things for others. When we are kind, we do nice things for others. For example, we can help our friends when they're feeling sad. For example, we can help our friends when they're feeling sad. We might share our toys or give a big smile to someone who looks lonely. We might share our toys or give a big smile to someone who looks lonely. Being kind means we care about how others feel. Being kind means we care about how others feel. We can also be kind to animals. We can also be kind to animals. We can give food to birds or pets. We can give food to birds or pets. When we're kind, it's like we're spreading love all around. When we're kind, it's like we're spreading love all around. Even small acts of kindness, like saying please and thank you, are important. Even small acts of kindness, like saying please and thank you, are important. These words show that we're polite and thoughtful. These words show that we're polite and thoughtful. Kindness doesn't have to be big or fancy. Kindness doesn't have to be big or fancy. We can be kind by listening when someone talks to us. We can be kind by listening when someone talks to us. It's like giving them a gift of our attention. It's like giving them a gift of our attention. We can also help our family by setting the table or cleaning up. We can also help our family by setting the table or cleaning up. 
These actions show that we care about our home and the people in it. These actions show that we care about our home and the people in it. When we're kind, we make the world a better place. When we're kind, we make the world a better place. People feel happy when someone is kind to them. People feel happy when someone is kind to them. It's like a warm hug for their heart. It's like a warm hug for their heart. So, let's remember to be kind every day, and we'll see how it brings smiles to everyone. So, let's remember to be kind every day, and we'll see how it brings smiles to everyone. Now, it's time to practice your English. I will give some jumbled words and you have to arrange them, in a proper way, to make sentences. First question. Is kindness thing a wonderful? Answer. Kindness is a wonderful thing. Second question. Can also kind we animals be too? Answer. We can also be kind to animals. Third question. Doesn't to be kindness have fancy? Answer. Kindness doesn't have to be fancy. Fourth question. A. Better we make place the world can. Answer. We can make the world a better place. Fifth question. Be kind every remember day to. Answer. Remember to be kind every day. Now let's improve your English vocabulary. Having a good vocabulary makes you a better speaker in English. I will provide you synonyms of some words in the passage. Synonyms are words that have same meanings. Learn and memorize them. First, wonderful, marvelous. Second, polite, courteous. Third, lonely, solitary. Well done, learners. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Comment down below, how many answers were you able to give? If you like the video then please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Comment and tell me what topic you want to practice next. Have a good day everyone.